Okay, what we're getting ready to try to do here is we have the new ground station app available with the new Vision 2 and the Vision 2 Plus. And I've never used a ground station before. It's where you can open up an app, see a map, put your finger on it, make a waypoint. The helicopter, set the elevation, set the speed, and I'm going to set it first very slow. And uh, you set the elevation of each waypoint. It will take off from here, supposedly, go to waypoint one, then go to waypoint two, and then come back and land. You can do that up to 16 waypoints. And we're in a open field here. And I am, I'm even gonna, if I can, I'm even gonna bring my waypoints even closer because I am scared to death that I'll end up in the trees since I don't have a good map here. I don't know why, but my map isn't cooperating with me well. So right now my waypoint is 300 feet that way and then about 300 feet that way and then about uh, less than 300 feet coming back to me. And the altitude of the first waypoint is 72 feet. Altitude of the second one is 82 feet. So uh, supposedly when I hit go, um, I don't have to do anything. Now it says home 82 feet, which I find confusing. It, it, maybe that's just going to come here and hover and then come down. I don't know. But as scary as this is, I'm going to try it. You can go ahead and turn to the copter now, Susie. And I'm going to drop, I'm going to hit go, and I'm going to let this go. Okay. There it goes to waypoint number one. And that's supposed to be about 60 some odd feet. Actually, right now it's about 50. It's get, gradually going up to the proper altitude. It's at about 70 feet right now, so that should be about as high as it goes. And once it gets to that waypoint, it should go in this direction over here to the other waypoint. I don't know how long it's supposed to stay there. But I also know that once a 30% of battery it's right at 59 feet. So, I mean, it's real close to where it's supposed to be right now. Once I get down to 30% battery, it's supposed to come back home, too. Maybe I should have put it on medium speed. Ooh, now it's moving. It's going the wrong direction, though. It's supposed to go over here. There you go. It had to find its GPS coordinate. Now it's going to, it's going to waypoint number two. I can't see it. Can you not see it? Yeah, there it is. It shows that on my on my screen here that it's flying to waypoint number two right now. Okay. Sh show yep. this, Susie. It's flying to waypoint number two right now, so it'll go up another 20 feet in altitude mm -hmm. and go to that waypoint. And then it should come to stay there for 15 seconds or whatever, and then come to my out come to my uh, home area. It's almost there. It's right at 80 feet high. It's supposed to go to 82 feet high. Now see, it's going to turn back to me. It's actually turning correctly to me. So the attitude turns to where the direction it's going. It's sitting there thinking, okay, now which way do I want to turn? Now it's coming to you. Now it's coming back to me. And my cell phone is getting low on battery. I've still got plenty of battery on all the other stuff. Now I could take over with it if I have to by flipping the switch, but we're almost here. I just hope it don't get on top of me then like fall out of the sky. <laughs> That's right over our heads. Now, is it going to descend on its own? I don't know. I'm going to let it sit for 15 minutes. 15 minutes? Or 15 seconds. It's coming down, I think. I don't know. No. 
Maybe not. Probably not, since home was at 80 yeah. feet. What? How high is it? Okay, now I got to get. Here's how I'm gonna get control of it. It's sitting at 82 feet. Okay, now I should have control of it again. I do. All I had to do was click it down to attitude, and then back to GPS. I'm gonna give it a little movement so I don't get caught in the backwash. Unbelievably cool. Just keep video on it, baby. Well, except for uh, landing on its own, and that's because I didn't do it right. For some reason, my home location uh, was still set at 82 feet, okay? If I had corrected that, and done it, probably if I'd done it all over again, uh, the home correction, the home would have been right here where it took off. And so it would have come back from the second coordinate and then come down and landed on its own. But this first time I've ever tried it, it's super cool. This way I can concentrate on using the camera and not have to worry about flying the helicopter. So all in all, it's pretty cool. Hope you enjoyed it. I know this wasn't the greatest video, but it was the best I could do on a, uh, on a whim and I'd like to thank Susie for running the uh, cell phone camera for me, and I hope you guys enjoyed this. Bye.